Something. Something. Based on me. Are we? Are we live? I hope. I hope that we are going out. As I said it's, it's upright this morning, <laughs> because uh, otherwise we're just talking between the two of us. It's just us. It's just you. Well, you know, anyway, it's just you and me. Anyway, hey. we're just up here. We're doing whatever. And our lovely Panther audience, we love you all. Yes, there's a total of three people in the library. Can anybody out there in the library hear us? If you can, give me a thumbs up. I'm not getting any thumbs up. No response. Do we have any thumbs up? Anybody? Oh, All right. Right. Okay. there we okay. go. All right. They we just go. weren't listening. <laughs> they were there. They are just not listening. Hey, you Panther community out there in live in Hamlin land and, and Lincoln County land. That's right. We are going live. We are pushing out to the entire community. Anybody who wants to watch. I don't really know if anybody ever. I do. There's a couple, couple people who watch. Late regularly. night entertainment, baby. Late night entertainment. <laughs> oh, so what do we got going on, on the agenda today? Uh, lunch. lunch. Let's look at lunch. What is today's day? Today is today the, is the sixteenth. The sixteenth. We Last are last week before Christmas break. Almost said spring break. Spring break. <laughs> Christmas break. It's not spring outside. It's Christmas break. It's spring in Australia. <laughs> oh, and there goes my phone. It's and not si- me today. It's not you. Anyways, we have chicken teriyaki today with fried rice, stir-fried vegetables, breadstick, mandarin oranges, sherbet. I wonder what flavor. Sherbet. Sh- What's your favorite sherbet flavor? I like the orange. Mm. I like the orange sherbet. It's I like a little raspberry. Sweet. Raspberry? Yes. Oh, that is a good. Or the, the, the lime that's really tart. Yeah. I got tart lime. Yeah. That's really good. I don't like to eat green <laughs> frozen stuff. <laughs> Fresh garden bar, by the way, with green stuff, milk, and, and your choice will be the chicken wrap. A chicken wrap. Yes. You know, went to BW3's last night. My wife got a, a chicken wrap, and she was like, she actually found something that she likes there. So I now have a free ticket to go back. <laughs> she doesn't. Uh, I That's one in a row, isn't I it? I don't really technically get to, She never, like, I'm like, let's go to BW3's. No, she always cuts me off. But she found something she likes, so we can go back now. Um, let's see. Let's talk about what, what are some things that happened last week? Oh, uh, well, our, our basketball team started their season. Um, Ooh, I heard that was a, cl- oh, it was, I really wanted to go. Yeah. Tulsa, I heard it was a pretty good match. And, uh, I went down to Spring Valley and saw them and, and they played well. And I got to say Spring Valley is tough. And, and, uh, I, mean, uh, I think they're ranked number two in the state, but, uh, our boys uh, did well. I was proud of them mm-hmm. uh, and cheered them on. And uh, I, I expect some wins this year, guys, and, and uh, just a uh, good year for you guys. Now, even though they didn't win, from what I understand, the pep club, oh, my, you guys, you guys did a phenomenal job. If you could irritate people enough to where they want to meet you outside of that gym door. Now, granted, I'm not promoting <clears throat> any of that kind of nonsense. No, no, no. no. But... But nonsense in the stands and goofing off and having a good time. I hear wow. they rocked the bus all the way into Kentucky because they were rocking so much the bus driver missed the turnoff in West Virginia. <laughs> and then Coach Plumley was telling me this morning like he was feeling like a little sad about you know about the loss. Yeah, who wouldn't? But then he got a text message as they're on their way back through that the pet bus was still going crazy, still making a ruckus all the way through Salt Rock. That's you know. Awesome. Not stopping at all, and and he said he got goosebumps, and that hey. that that was that, I love those kinds of stories. That's dude. what high school's about, man. Oh my lord, that that was phenomenal. And you guys, bravo! Thank you for returning my monkey outfit. You know they <laughs> there were monkey outfits. I you saw can, you uh, could the, say so many things about that. They were in hey. <laughs> That's the best money I've ever spent on a Halloween costume. But anyway, they uh, they uh, they were in the big capes. They were people were dressed up. They had all kinds of props with them, and uh, just I can't say enough about that. By the way, you guys, uh, the shirts are in. Apparently, should be in AA. Going to go get those right now. Miss Stickler has them. I think Miss Porter has some. Mr. If you Plumley. Coach Plumley, if you got them from them, go get them. I'm gonna go pick up mine here in a little bit. Mm-hmm. I ordered a big one. I keep getting text messages, but apparently because I, we're supposed to also announce that the girls' first home game is today, today against Point Pleasant. Point Pleasant. Woo! The, they're not the Pointers anymore. They're, no. The Pointers was South Point. No, they're the Big Blacks. The Big Blacks. Yeah, yeah. Still a very odd name. Yes. It's, it's, I, it's I, I thought they were Black Knights. Knights. But, they, yeah. but then I wondered about that myself. It's really weird. Calling somebody big. Yeah, it's. I take offense to that. Uh, me too. 
I'm not big, I'm fluffy. <laughs> fluffy. Nah. I By the way, might be a little bit speaking more. of fluffy, don't we love this snow? Uh, and, and we want to remind you that we are going snow tubing on January 17th. I have permission to slip in my room. Come get one. Uh, they are due back when we come back from Christmas that Friday. So um, don't forget about it and then come later on and say, can I go, can I go? Because the money has to be sent in. And, and by the way, our bobsled team will be uh, training as we go down there because we do have the West Virginia Invitational in February down at Winter Place. So mm -hmm. uh, that's our one state championship uh, in Winter Place. Everything else is pretty much international. And, and we're getting pretty, ready for Sochi, uh, uh, Russia, too, for the Olympics this year. This is going to be great time for Panther bobsled. Oh, no kidding. Now, I will tell you about, about your uh, snow teaming trip. I went last year. I had a ball. Oh, it is it so was, much it, fun. It was a lot of fun, you know. And, you know, it, it, if it gets a little bit warm and those those tracks just start to glean with ice, oh, <laughs> uh, there's several people hit the fence. And I was, have it, many times. I've wiped out some people walking my way. They, you don't walk in the yes. way. You see a big man in a round tube coming down a hill Stop. very fast. And get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Because he doesn't have brakes. <laughs> Speaking of getting out of the way, since you're the driver's air instructor, I've got this. This is my one gripe that happened to me this morning. I have a little road rage. I can I can admit that. But am I am I wrong in assuming that if the speed limit is 55 miles an hour, yes, that it is extremely dangerous to be driving 25 miles an hour? Yes. Yeah. Because here's Basically the Basically anything. They'll, they'll pull you over sometimes oh. 15, 20 miles under the speed limit because you're as much of a danger as the idiots driving 80 miles an hour. Exactly, yeah. I can understand going this morning on my way to work. Uh, some, whoever was in front of me, from, from Huntington all the way to Salt Rock, 25 miles an hour. And it wasn't like I was stuck behind like a big 18-wheeler or whatever. It was a little grandma in a car. I, I, I want to say grandma. It probably was. It was just somebody who was just real cautious about the snow. But I was afraid for my life because we're going 25 miles an hour. You're around a blind curve. If somebody behind you is going 55 around a corner, they can't stop fast enough. So if you're going too slow, pull over let the people around you. And, and if we're on pet peeves of driving, of course, I have a list. My kids in class know. But... Uh, why do you drive with your parking lights on? I don't know. Yeah. Some people say to be seen. Well, your headlights will help even better. I passed two cars this morning, and I get here about 7 o'clock when it's Ooh, dark. It's still with just dark. their parking lights on. Turn your headlights on, you morons. Oh, you're right. I do. I do. I hope headlights. this goes out in the community, and, and yeah, some I'll, of the morons yes, catch on. Please. Because I drive with headlights and fog lights. Yes. All the time. Just, it it's doesn't constant. waste electricity. No, because your alternator You're generates You're not putting it. a coal miner out of work. No. <laughs> um. All right, see, so let's see what else is on the agenda. I keep getting texts from people here. Um, please announce that the Venture Crew will meet tomorrow after school. In my room, I think, still. Yeah. 11.09. So. Now, the Venture Crew looks, is really cool. Like yes. When I was in high school, we, we had Raiders. Um, I, was, I was on the Raider team, Raider team commander, um, just like we have here. But a lot of what we did was out there. We went on FTX all the time. We went camping. We did a lot of the cool stuff that these guys get to do. And if you're not an ROTC or JROTC, I think this, this venture crew is like a great yeah. way to get involved in oh, that. Oh, it's a lot of fun. Yeah. We, we kind of sort of had one at Duval and, and tied it in with FCA. We went uh, on ski trips mm -hmm. and uh, went whitewater rafting and uh, things we're not allowed to do anymore. Uh, but, you know, maybe someday we'll be allowed to do them again. Uh, but... Uh, Anyways, what else have we got coming up? Uh, Adrian Young uh, would like to announce that he loves tacos. Yes. Oh, yeah. By the way, the internet is down today. Like, we just got interrupted with a, uh, with a uh, announcement. An announcement. Uh, there, it's going to be happening a lot today. The internet is out. Mr. Gosney is out. Uh, they're, they're looking to get somebody to come in here to reset the servers. The Goss is gone. The Goss is gone. He's uh, in Bridgeport doing uh, his Gosney training. They do this every, you know, you got to keep up to date with yes. your hours. I mean, you got to keep up. And that's what he's doing. Uh, <clears throat> hey, semester test this week. I uh, want to encourage you all to do your best. Yes. Uh, uh, I, I've, kids in my youth group is freaking out from other schools. And I said, just say a prayer before you go in. Ask God. Oh, maybe I'm not supposed to do that. But uh, you ask can. God to help you out and do your best, man. I, I'll say a prayer for you, too. If you stop me in the hall and say, say a prayer for me, I will. Because be glad to do it. You don't ever be embarrassed about saying that on uh, here. I, you, this is, we're going this out. This is a great this school, is, This too. is beyond, you know, I'm not, we're not worried about this. I really don't think there's anybody in our community who will care about that. Yeah, they you encourage that stuff. That's like, right. want to be involved. 
Uh, <laughs> Adrian Young says he prefers the, uh, the some famous name wins the Heisman. Some, Is some, this annoying? Uh, Aaron Smith. I I keep saying I'm blocking Aaron, Aaron Smith. Smith. Put put your phone away at school. That's right. Um, we're uh, coming to confiscate it right now. And I know who your parents are and where you live. You are family. <laughs> I have been given permission to take it and keep it. Uh, your mom will have it tonight. Uh, James, <laughs> I keep getting auto cracks. Anyway, we're going to get off of that. So uh, we've got big final exams this week. My guys, uh, six period. Your guys' project is due this week. Hopefully today for most of you if you got it done. Uh, video projects. Some of them really. I've got some that were turned in early. They were they were pretty cool. Um, hey, if you want to see some of our driver's ed videos, uh, put search L C H S D R E D. Uh, there were some fun ones, some some good ones, and uh, uh, take a chance and, and look at them because those of you who have me next semester, you'll have to do one yeah. too. Surprise! I will tell you this. Not a. I mean, there were only a handful of kids who. A bunch of kids came to me and said they wanted me to help with them, and I was yes, I will help. I'm not doing it for you, but I will help. Only like two or three people took me up on that offer. Well, that's because they procrastinated. And then they procrastinated wait till the last minute. Yeah. yeah, don't wait till the last minute, guys. Um, let's see. Is there anything else we got going on? We got testing going on this week. Uh, <laughs> uh, I keep getting. I'm gonna just turn this over that way because people keep now sending me all kinds of crazy things to put on the live news this morning. We should have like a ticker feed or something comes up. That... Just a reminder too, Friday is what they call an IS day and maybe you're not sure what that means but if you have work that you need to get made up for a teacher, mm -hmm. talk with them. You can come in Friday morning and get that work done. Yeah. Uh, it's a perfect time for it. So Two hours set aside every day from 8 to 10. Uh, or for every IS day, yes. IC day from 8 to 10, two hours, come in, get your work done. That's the bell. We're Go done. Class. Go to class. Have a good day. Feliz Navidad. Mr. Ice, high five. Woo! And we're done. Merry Christmas from Cletus. Don't forget to check us out on our YouTube page and tweet at us at FCHS Pride. And remember, use your cell phone during the school day. That's a Cletus to do. No! Shame on you, Cletus. Nuh uh. You can't use your cell phone during the school day. That's a school rule. I'm sorry, Dave. That's okay, Cletus. Bye-bye for now.